how, how, how comfortable do all of you feel talking? A skit would be more impressive. Yes. Yeah, the one thing that we've seen is a whole group comes in here and you have one or two talkers and the rest are there in support, but they're not participating in the presentation. So a skit would be impressive if you could find ways to include everyone, even the, the shy ones. So you want us to be all confident and shy and for everyone else to do a skit? It would be much better if everybody on this team and I know that everyone on this team is smart. You wouldn't be doing this. If everyone on this team could contribute something, I don't care if it's a sentence or two, okay? All you gotta do when you talk to, when you have a big bunch of people, so see my hat, see where it says 13, 19, or look at it, don't look at me, look at this, look at my hat, and talk. You don't have to look at me, look at my hat and talk. I have something to look back at you, don't make no noise, it ain't gonna frown at you, no nothing. Okay? The first thing you do is come in here, smile. Don't feel like you're gonna get shot because we're not gonna step on you or kick you or spit after you or anything. Okay? The second thing you do when you talk is talk loud. Well, you are gonna be loud, you're gonna say, well, I'm not gonna shout, I'm not gonna need to shout. But you need to talk loud because loud shows that you, I can hear you. What was your question, Sam? Um, but if you're looking at your hat, are you going to see if you're smiling or not? What? Okay. So if you're smiling... You don't care if I'm smiling or not. You don't care about me. You just want to give your presentation. If you can, if you can look, if you're if you're not too shy or you can look at someone and, and talk to them, then go ahead and try to do that. If you're a shy person, you give me an example of how you can get past that shyness and you know, easy to talk. You can be a real smart person, and know what you're doing, but she doesn't know she's doing. But she talks just a little bit too shy. She's talking a little bit louder. That's why I'm doing this. Trying to get out and say, I can't hear you. You talk a little bit louder. So, okay. so your PowerPoint, uh, you have a PowerPoint idea, you have a skit idea, and what was the third one? Picture book. Picture book, okay. Um, I think a picture book would, would probably be better than a PowerPoint, unless you're gonna come in here and bring up large uh, monitor or something like that to present um, pictures. You know when you show the letters yeah. on this, it'd be more effective if you had those letters at the presentation and you did each one of them did it here. Because that gives each one here a chance to do what? To make a noise, talk in front of the judges. Okay, I, wonderful. I'm not going to do that. I'm not going to that. We had a hard time because I couldn't hear most of the wrong because it turned out to but it's better off if you talk. The days of having a PowerPoint presentation, when you do it, that's almost going by. It's kind of like a fun day. And then we have a board here. Oh, let's see your board. I bet that board. Have you finished the board? Not so much. Okay, you got your letters. There you go. See, if you had that, that's almost word over. If you had that set on one side, you had all your letters, and you did that thing we're talking about, like you all sit like this, and the first person said A, let's see you're the first person. You pick up the A, and you walk down here, talking about the A as you do it, and stand there, and the next one comes over, and the next one comes over, and finally you're all standing here.